I'm everybody, Divya Panditya. So here I, as I promised, I will be coming up with the, the solar eclipse video too, 8th of April. Well, a lot of things are said on YouTube and internet and this and that about the solar eclipse. However, nothing to worry. It is just another eclipse. Yes, it is very important because any solar eclipse is an important day for all the spiritual people especially because the energies are very chaotic and very high especially on a solar eclipse the lunar eclipse that went you know that got you all into an emotional state of mind that got a lot of in, inner conflict conflict in relationships or probably there are a lot of overwhelming emotions uh, coming out of a lot of zodiac signs and a lot of people okay but the solar eclipse is all about outer energy outer energy that is like what we call in hindi bahari badha ya bahari cheeze okay anything that is outer will show up after this solar eclipse okay any kind of action taking any type of karma that is going to show up after the solar eclipse so the solar eclipse is a very important day in terms of your karmic energy in terms of your actions reactions to people up till now if you have not been someone who has uh, you know been very um, careful about their conduct or their actions now you have to be the zodiacs and that uh, have to be very careful after the solar eclipse are libra especially and the other one is Aquarius. Libra and Aquarius have to be very, very careful. It is a little heavy on them. Okay. For Libra, although it's a very balanced sign, one part of them is that they shy away from taking responsibility. Okay. They will act like a victim when they are, it's their fault. So those kind of karma, they have to be very careful. Aquarians have to be especially very careful about their money area. Money area and sometimes, uh, sometimes means after the eclipse, it might happen that uh, they will go through some kind of blockages. Okay, so Libra and Aquarius have to be very, very careful after this solar eclipse energy. And partly I will say Aries also. Partly Aries also. Okay, 50% you can say for Aries. So these three zodiac signs have to be very, very careful after the eclipse. Anyways, we have still not gotten over the uh, lunar eclipse energy. So again with the solar eclipse, there's a lot of chaos going on right now in the universe. A lot of things are happening. A lot of planetary chaos is going on. So uh, generally we have to really take care while we are traveling, while we are, you know, conducting our relationships, while we are doing all sorts of things and now is yes, before the solar eclipse from the 1st of april solar eclipse is on the 8th and the 1st of april the mercury retrograde is starting till the 25th so uh, there is a lot of chaos going on a lot of chaos okay be careful of cheaters be careful of signing papers uh, without uh, you know monitoring the papers be careful of people saying something and do some, doing something else don't believe anyone who says that person loves you and cares about you till the 25th of April if so someone is telling you that tell them come after 25th and let's see <laughs> okay uh, do not sign any contracts mindlessly in this time all right now the 8th of April which is one of the heaviest days and it's one of the best days for spiritual people okay people who want to increase their spiritual power and people who want to do wrong things so there are a lot of black magic and negativity throwing also going on at this time so a lot of protection has to be done a lot of protection i have got you some remedies uh, which you all can do on the solar eclipse day okay the timing in india of the solar uh, eclipse is 9 p.m. to 12 p.m. sort of a thing 9 p.m. to 12 p.m. I think and uh, this is a time where we are supposed to only pray pray and pray why if you want to increase your spiritual power if you want to increase your um, manifestations now see Sun is all about actions 
Sun is all about work. Sun is all about promotion. Sun, sun is all about uh, rising in your life. Okay, so it's more mostly your father energy, right? So if we are praying, meditating at this time, chanting Gayatri Mantra, chanting uh, Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya, any mantra that you can you feel at that time that is very close to your heart which will help you to increase your uh, spiritual power do it you will actually see the difference okay and people who feel who have negativity black magic on them then i will be giving you some remedies which because on this day i'll tell you cleansing is very important don't miss out on uh, eclipses to cleanse yourself that because that is the best day to remove any kind of negativity and black magic from your life okay Cleansing on a uh, eclipse day is actually going to, that whole year is going to go very well for you. And you will see, you will become spiritually stronger, you will have internal strength and next time nobody will be able to ever touch you again. See, negativity is there, people do all sorts of things on others, out of, I don't know why people waste their energy in harming others, rather using the same thing for their own betterment. I don't know, I still don't understand. Uh, it all comes from their own unworthiness and low self-esteem and so on. So we have a right to protect ourselves, right? The more we protect ourselves, the better it is. Alright? So solar eclipse, use that day to protect yourself and your family. Remove all sort of negativity from your life. I also have a switch word, okay, which you can use on the day of solar eclipse. If you chant this, um, people who have uh, Grahan Yog, Shrapit Dosh in their Kundalis, it will also help. Chant this at least 28 times. Okay? 28 times you chant this during the eclipse, it will really help you. People who are low in confidence, people who are uh, all the time procrastinating and taking action in their work. Okay? The switch word is up, 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 three times up, 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 put, full, together up 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 put full together okay chant this 28 times during the eclipse it will really really help you rise your energy okay anything that is going to affect you negatively that time also it will help it will help in other cases where like i said people who have shrapit dosh or grahan yoga in their kundalini it will help them also right now the remedy for solar eclipse what you need to do now normally uh, if anybody who has a heavy rahu on them okay and even if you don't have those people also can do this remedy. after the solar eclipse is done the next day uh, donations are very very important okay now this donation you will do in a very particular way right people who are living in india Okay, now there are two types of remedies. I know there are people who don't have people tree ab abroad and they keep commenting on my video. So, people who live in India can buy some barley, which is in Hindi called jau. Okay, buy 1 kg jau. Right? Now, what you are going to do is take the jau, keep it on the root of the people tree. Alright? And take 7 times parikrama of the tree okay clockwise i'm talking about so take seven times parikrama of the people tree and just straight away go home do not look back this is for people who live in india now people who live abroad you all can just donate food grains anything raw or cooked to anybody who is needy now there are many countries there are uh, homeless people you can go and donate over there or you can go and do it, donate in some animal shelter or any any orphanage orphanages if you have there are a lot of uh, you know uh, organization even online you can go and do donations over there who are living abroad okay now the remedy to remove any kind of evil eye black magic lower low vibrating energies take a coconut now which coconut you're going to take you're going to take the coconut that we keep in the puja. The one with the all fiber. Not the one with water, not that. The one with the fiber, okay. You take that coconut. You take a black thread. 
you measure yourself from your toe to your head you take the thread you keep it under your toe and you measure it till here till your head little above your head here okay you tie it to the coconut and you're going to go to a place where there are very less people or no one okay little far away you you break the coconut over there okay now the thread that you have measured yourself from you're going to dig a hole and bury it in the same place and you're going to cover, leave the coconut there and come back while coming back do not look back okay when you come home when you come home you're going to wash your hands and your feet hands and your feet both with salt any salt salt that is you have at home will do hands and feet from your salt or take an entire salt water bath this will really help you in getting rid of all the negative energies black magic in your life you will notice after this eclipse there will be a lot of conflict you know a lot of chaos happening in politics our indian polity is also going to face a lot of chaos a lot of fighting globally there will be chaos um, in uh, politics difference of opinion two countries fighting you know arguing more of arguments will increase and even if your family has too much of politics then the <laughs> arguments will increase so anywhere there is manipulation and politics it's going to create a conflict after this eclipse you will see a lot of global chaos after this okay i also say that uh, this is my prediction there are many people who will also have promotions they will have up to now people who did not get up promotions they get promotions there will be a lot of awakening spiritual awakening is going to happen after this uh, eclipse there are more, there are people who will uh, who are not doing well will start doing well there are people who are looking suppose i am doing a certain kind of job i will suddenly change my stream there are many people who will change their profession or change their stream after this eclipse that is happening on the 8th of april so it is very very important a lot of things are going to happen after this and uh, this year please be careful because this year might trigger some kind of calamities also uh, this whole year so please be careful and just remove your negativity so you're in a safe space always and do chant the switch word so that that gives you a very positive effect in your life all right so i hope you like this video take care and coming up with more videos as i promised and do share this video with your family and friends email me and whatsapp me for paid appointments follow me on x facebook and instagram facebook has hindi content so go there take care goodbye god bless stay healthy and stay safe bye bye